But how did he do that? Pause. Zoom in. This 50k coin sword allows players to deal more than 200 million damage. This video will show you how to deal this much damage with this cheap of a sword. First, let's talk about your gear requirements. You need to go to the description for that. It's too long to fit in here. Pause the video and read the description first. Once you're back, you'll see exactly how to do this epic play. First, let's talk about how to effectively spawn the boss. You'll need a pet with a bubblegum pet item. That sounds like a skyblock thing. Don't give my pet bubblegum. Just don't do this at home. This gives your overflux orb twice its duration, which is very useful. Once you do spawn the boss, you need to immediately switch to your reaper mask and summon the tank zombies. Skip to the end of the video to find out the most efficient way to get tank zombies. Okay, side note, who thought it would be a good idea to give a zombie a tank? Please switch to your wither goggles. Now you need to hit the boss twice with your Midas staff to face skip. You need to hit it once from around 5 blocks away, then come up right next to it and use the Midas staff again. Uh, this is because the Midas staff has a cooldown, so to make sure you can hit the boss twice before it becomes invulnerable, you will need to do this. So while the boss is in its laser phase and hit phase, you need to shoot the boss with a bow of your choice. Make sure to have the twilight arrow poison in your inventory for extra damage. After this, swap to the reaper masks, summon your tanks, and switch back to the wither goggles. Now comes the most important part. Make sure you're on 10 crimson stacks. Then when the boss exits its hit phase, hit it once with your Hyperion, then switch to your Endstone Sword, use its ability, and use Midas Spoon. Don't worry if you miss, your next hit will apply the same damage boost. If you do miss. Okay, another side note. Last I checked, Endstone Swords didn't exist in vanilla Minecraft, but this is Skyblock, so I shouldn't be surprised. And Midas Spoons to attack people? Like, just use a, like, anything. I, I don't know. Spoons. You, you, you have access, swords, bows. My personal un-skyblock experience says don't use spoons. Uh, if you're interested how to get tank zombies, you have to go to master mode floor 1 because those zombies are the best. They have the highest drop chance out of any tank zombies. Uh, just don't get floor 3 or master mode 3 tank zombies. Those take forever to get and the floor 3 ones have very little HP. Use a summoning ring in your inventory and just clear. It should take you less than a minute.